Is the accounting profession in crisis? The CPA Journal, or the self-titled Voice of the Profession, recently posted a rather dramatic article on how the accounting profession is in crisis. The AICPA, which is the professional organization for CPAs, had 428,000 members in 2020. And apparently, 75% or 75% times 428,000, 321,000 of those members are at retirement age. I have so many questions. Why are CPAs so old? Or are the members of the AICPA just really old? Did I bring the average age down a couple years when I joined? Back to the article, which starts off by saying the profession is facing a severe crisis due to the shortage of accountants. Not only is the number of current accountants dwindling, but the number of accounting students is also dropping. 300,000 accountants left the profession between 2019 and 2021. One private university saw a 34% drop in accounting majors between 2015 to 2019. Less accounting students means the number of those taking the CPA exam is dropping. In fact, there is a 33% reduction in those taking the CPA exam from 2016 to 2021. The CPA Journal gives a list of reasons why there is a shortage of accounting majors. The 150-hour requirement to become a CPA. We're boring. We don't get paid as much compared to finance bros or tech nerds. We're not diverse. Accounting is too specialized. College is too expensive. Less people are going to college. I'd like to note that in a previous article from the CPA Journal, the Big Four Tweets X account was described as part of the reason why Accountants have an image problem. So an X account that posts memes about the accounting industry is why we're in this crisis. Yeah, the post can be cynical towards the accounting industry, but here's the thing. They are holding up a mirror to the profession reflecting what's actually happening. You can't blame a storyteller for what's happening in a story when they are just sharing the story, not writing the story. Back to the original article. The purpose of the article was supposedly to talk about the 150 hour requirement as the reason for the accounting crisis, specifically the CPA shortage. If you didn't know, I'm a CPA. I know, I know. It looks like I should have been a model for Calvin Klein. But instead, I got a master's in accounting and became a CPA. From my experience, I never thought having to have 150 hours of college credit was dumb while I was going through the accounting program. I was just happy to be in college and not being an adult. Back when I was in college, there weren't people on social media posting about how the quality of life of public accountants was terrible and the pay didn't match the amount of work they did. I'm not sure if accountants realized at the time how they were getting screwed. That or no one seemed to be questioning why it was that way. It wasn't until about five years into my career where I started to question the economics of it all. How are we getting paid so little compared to all the work that we do and the stress that we endure? The article proposes two solutions to help out the accounting crisis caused by the 150 hour requirement. Option one, remove the 150 hour requirement with what I'm assuming is just a 120 hour requirement, but they didn't say. Option two, a convoluted mix of a 120 hour requirement if you take all four parts of the CPA exam or have to take three parts of the exam if you have 150 hours. I know the article wants to zoom in on the 150 hour requirement, but I think that pay and quality of life has more of an impact than having to go to school for another year. Then again, I was in a master's program to get those extra 30 hours, so I thought it was valuable to my career. But those that are taking random classes like walking probably think the extra hours are pointless. What you do see on Reddit a lot is people are sharing how horrible the quality of life is. So what's going on? Um, I'm gonna start crying. It's okay. So I am a tax accountant and I'm sorry. Okay. They just put a lot of pressure on me. So busy season that day went and I had to work 50, 60, 70 hours a week. Uh, okay. Stayed up all night, sometimes 3, 4 a.m. I'd like to propose a question. Does the decrease in new accountants really matter? We've been talking about U.S. accountants this whole time. A lot of accounting firms are utilizing offshore teams because they are cheaper and they can do just as good as a job 
as their U.S. counterparts. I've noticed most modern accounting firms are using offshore teams to help with their accounting and tax work. And most modern firms seem to prioritize not burning out their employees. I think we're on the cusp of an accounting profession revolution. Something is going to have to change and change in a big way if CPAs want to stay relevant. And right now, the change looks like using accountants from other countries. I'm 100% pro CPA, but the public accounting industry needs to change. And I can't wait to see when that day comes, if it ever does. Thanks for watching. Cheers. Mmm.